So with this video we'll start solving questions on percentage. Let us get started with the first question. The ratio 5 is to 4 expressed as percent equals to. So we have 5 is to 4. So 5 is to 4 is represented as 5 by 4. And to express it in percent we'll have to multiply it by 100. So this is equals to 4 times 25 is 100 and 25 times 5 is 125. So 125 is the right answer. Let's move on to the second question. 3.5 can be expressed in terms of percentage as. So again we have the number just multiplied by 100 get the percentage. So 3.5 times 100 and that will be equal to we'll shift the decimal points two places to the right because we have multiplied this by 100 so 1 and 2 so we have 350 percent easy questions right let's jump on to the next half of 1 percent written as decimal is so 1 percent can be written as 1 by 100 and we have to take the half of it so times 1 by 2 and that will give us the decimal equivalent of this. So this is equal to 1 by 100 times 2 or basically we can write this as 1 by 2 can be written as 0 0.5. So this is equals to 1 by 100 times 0 0.5. So this is equal to 0 0.5 by 100 and we will have to shift the decimal two places to the left. So 1 and 2. So this will give us 0 0.5 zero zero five so the correct answer is option a what is fifteen percent of thirty four rupees so we have fifteen percent of thirty four so we can write it as fifteen percent of thirty four and how do you solve this well fifteen percent can be represented as fifteen by hundred and off is basically multiplication 34 so 15 by 100 times 34 so if you have anything like percentage of something so this is basically to represent the percentage as decimal fraction and times that number now we can cancel out terms here 2 times 17 is 34 and 2 times 50 is 100 now 5 times 10 is 50 and 5 times 3 is 15 so 3 times 17 by 10 let's write it 3 times 17 by 10 17 times 3 gives you 51 51 upon 10 and that is equals to 5.1 so rupees 5.10 is the correct answer so this one's the next question that we have what could be the answer well you have 88% of 370 so it is equivalent to 88 upon 100 times 370 plus you have 24 percent of 210 so it is equivalent to 24 upon 100 times 210 minus of x is equals to 118 so it 118 so we can solve this 0 and 0 gets cancelled out here also 0 and 0 gets cancelled out now we have 88 times 37 and that is equivalent to 3256 so we have 3256 divided by 10 plus 24 times 21 is equal to 504 so 504 by 10 minus x is equals to 118 so this is 325.6 plus 50.4 minus 118 is equals to x moving the x to the right hand side so 325.6 plus 50.4 is equal to 376 minus 118 is equals to x and 376 minus 118 will give you 258 so the correct answer is option b finally the last question 0.01 is what percent of 0.1? Well, let us rewrite this question. 0.01 is what percent of 
0 0.1 and let us uh, consider this question mark as x so I can write 0 0.01 is equal to what percent of 0 0.1 so x percent of 0 0.1 and that can be rewritten as 0 0.01 is equal to x upon 100 x percent is x upon 100 times 0 0.1 and that is 0 0.01 times 100 is equals to 0 0.1 x and uh, 0 0.01 times 100 is 1 is equals to x times 0 0.1 and 0 0.1 can be rewritten as 1 by 10 so this 10 goes here so x is equals to 10 so we have the answer 10 option C